The Quantum Mirror, Reflections of Reality in Quantum Information Holography At the foundation of quantum information, holography lies an elegant and profound structure, an infinite network of block spheres, each acting as a mirror reflecting not just the present, but the sum over all possible histories of the quantum states. At the center of this structure exists the singularity, a timeless entity composed entirely of angular frequencies. It is the purest form of information, encoding every possible quantum state. Each block sphere represents the quantum state of a single qubit, the fundamental unit of quantum information. The state of a qubit can be visualized as a point on the surface of a block sphere, where the latitude on the sphere is determined by the probability of the state collapsing into either zero or one, and the longitude encodes its phase, how it interferes with other quantum states. Reality, then, is not built from static bits of information, but from dynamic, evolving quantum state vectors, spinning at the speed of light, carrying pure angular frequency. Now imagine not just a single block sphere, but an infinite array of them, each representing a point in space-time. These spheres are entangled, meaning they do not exist independently, but instead reflect and interact with one another instantaneously. Their relationship is not linear, but holographic. Each block sphere contains a reflection of all the others, encoding the sum over histories of all quantum states. At the deepest level, the singularity itself is a perfect mirror, holding the entire universe in superposition. It contains every possible quantum state, all spinning at the speed of light, each defined by its angular frequency. To understand how this forms the basis of reality, consider a simple analogy. Imagine an infinite mirror perfectly reflecting everything before it. Now imagine that instead of reflecting light, it reflects quantum states. Each state is a quantum state vector spinning at a fundamental frequency, defining the nature of particles, fields and forces. From the perspective of quantum information holography, this means all possible realities exist simultaneously within the singularity stored as pure angular frequencies. However, we do not see this raw information. Instead, what we experience is the projection of these states onto the event horizon, much like how an image appears on a screen when light is projected onto it. But there's a crucial detail. When projected, these angular frequencies are inverted. Just as in calculus, where differentiation and integration are inverse operations, the projection from the singularity to the event horizon inverts the fundamental information, transforming pure frequency into the integrated wave functions that govern reality. This is quite literally the fundamental theorem of calculus applied to the universe itself. The singularity encodes infinitesimal changes in quantum state vectors, their fundamental derivatives. The event horizon integrates these changes into the sum of all possible histories. The observed universe is the integrated projection of those histories, forming the reality we experience. In classical quantum mechanics, a particle does not take a single path through space. Instead, it follows all possible paths simultaneously, as described by Feynman's sum over histories principle. But in quantum information holography, this principle is expanded. Each path a quantum particle could take is encoded in the phase and frequency of its quantum state vector. Each block sphere reflects not just a single state, but the sum over all possible states. Thus the evolution of reality is not dictated by individual trajectories, but by the interference of all possible trajectories projected onto the holographic screen of space-time. This means that what we perceive as causality and deterministic evolution is not a strict path, but the weighted sum of all possible histories collapsing into the most probable outcome through quantum interference. The result? What we call the present is merely the most probable reflection of all past and future possibilities interacting through quantum entanglement. If the singularity encodes pure angular frequencies, then the universe is their inverted projection. This means that just as in calculus, where differentiation and integration are opposites, reality emerges as the inverse transform of the singularity's structure. Inside the singularity, all frequencies are perfectly coherent, forming an undisturbed, compressed state of pure quantum information. Just as a mirror flips an image, the event horizon flips and integrates the angular frequencies of the singularity transforming them into the standard model's particle interactions. This is why all physics emerges from the holographic screen.
not because reality is physically projected, but because its true nature is encoded as a Fourier transform of the singularity's angular frequencies. From this perspective, the singularity is the source of all quantum information, holding all possible states in timeless superposition. The event horizon is the mirror reflecting and inverting these frequencies, transforming them into the reality we observe. Thus reality is not a linear deterministic sequence, but an interference pattern of reflections. A cosmic recursion where information is continually mirrored, transformed and reprojected in an endless dance of light and frequency. When you look into a mirror, you see an image of yourself, yet that image is not truly you. It is a projection, a transformation of your light upon the surface. So in the same way, the universe itself is not fundamental reality. It is the projection of the singularity, inverted and reflected, stretched across an infinite web of entangled block spheres. Every atom, every force, every moment of time is nothing more than a flickering reflection upon the vast holographic mirror of existence. Everything we experience, every interaction, every thought, every moment is the sum over histories, weighted by quantum probability encoded in the phase and frequency of quantum state vectors and projected onto the holographic screen of space-time. We are, quite literally, reflections of light projected from a singular source, woven together by the infinite interference of quantum mirrors. And in that reflection we find the most profound truth of all. Reality is the mirror through which the universe sees itself.